Namaste to all the viewers. Today I'll be discussing one of the most frequently asked question, which direction should you be sleeping? Now, most of you know that every video out there on YouTube says that you should not be sleeping towards the north side, facing the north side. But it does not hold the same truth if you are in Australia, if you are in South America. So stay tuned, I'll be discussing about all that. So why you should not be sleeping facing the north side? The thing is, because your blood is made up of hemoglobin and hemoglobin is made up of iron, now, if you're facing towards the north side, uh, half an hour, one hour, doesn't matter. But if you're sleeping longer, like six hours, seven hours at night time, so what happens is slowly and slowly there's a pooling of blood because of the magnetic field of the earth, your blood gets uh, pooled towards the brain side and that makes your brain more active. So in short, you will be getting more dreams, you will be restless, your quality of sleep will not be good and that means you will be getting more dreams. The same principle holds for the south. The thing is, if you're above the equator line, you should not be sleeping facing the north direction. But what if you're in Australia? What if you are in South America? What if in you are in New Zealand? So there, you should not be sleeping facing the south for the same principle. So if you're facing the south direction in Australia while you're sleeping, that means more blood will be pulled towards your brain you will, your brain will be more active, you will be dreaming more and that is one of the most important reason the thing is a patient who is hypertensive, already hypertensive and more blood flows towards the brain so he may end up having a cerebrovascular attack uh, if he's not on medication of uh, blood pressure. So if you're above the equator line, avoid sleeping facing the north. If you're below the equator line, avoid sleeping to the south. Other three directions are perfectly normal. You can sleep in any of the three directions. Uh, that's all for today. Namaste. Om Namah Shivaya.